gold prices surged to unprecedented levels last week, reaching record highs, with central bank activity and geopolitical tensions serving as primary catalysts. Gold rallied to a new all-time high, ignoring a strong March non-farm payrolls report in the United States, which could prevent the Federal Reserve from slashing rates sooner than the market expects. In achieving its milestone, the yellow metal ignored the rise in U.S. Treasury yields and the greenback, which clings to modest gains of 0.1%. Geopolitical risks loom following Israel's attack on Iran's embassy in Syria. A further escalation could pressure gold prices upward, with traders looking at the $2,360 figure. Although last week witnessed a notable spike in gold prices, the bulk of these gains occurred on Friday, indicating volatility rather than sustained growth. This sudden upsurge is partly attributed to central bank maneuvers and speculative trading, rather than firm underlying fundamentals. However, I would advise traders to be cautious, as the current rally might not be as robust as it seems. In recent times, central banks have exhibited considerable appetite for gold, evident in the total demand of 1,037 metric tons recorded in 2023. Nevertheless, the actual influence of central bank acquisitions might be less transparent than presumed. Historically shrouded in secrecy, central bank actions could potentially exert indirect influence on market dynamics. The opacity surrounding their purchasing behavior raises doubts regarding the true drivers behind gold's price escalation. There is mounting apprehension that the current valuation of gold is inflated due to speculative activities. Traders may be overly optimistic, banking on future central bank acquisitions, a strategy susceptible to reversal if market conditions undergo a shift. The abrupt volatility witnessed on Friday serves as a cautionary reminder against unwarranted confidence in the gold market. The recent rally in gold is speculative, so traders should be cautious and consider implementing stop losses to protect gains. The market appears poised for a potential downturn, indicating a cautious bearish outlook. When markets are set to rise, seasoned professionals typically encourage new traders to buy into strength. However, on Friday, they allowed them to buy into weakness instead. This suggests that many new buyers entered the market around $50 from its record high. If the market were to suddenly decline, these new buyers could find themselves trapped. Indeed, Friday's activity resembled more of a bull trap than a springboard to new highs. A sustained move under $2,280 will signal the presence of sellers. This could trigger a sharp break into $2,230, followed by the main bottom at $2,150, supported by a 50-day moving average. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to support the channel if you enjoyed the video. See you in the next one.